While young star Haley Steinfeld could have afforded her own mansion years ago, she's long chosen to live with her parents in their family mansion. However, that's finally about to change. While Haley loves the Thousand Oaks residence she grew up in, and why wouldn't she? The home is massive with luxury features like a pool, she's finally got some real estate of her own. Just recently, it was reported that Haley dropped $8 million on a recently renovated mansion in Encino, which formerly belonged to another famous face. In this video, we're gonna see where the starlet calls home. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Haley Steinfeld is an actress and singer who began her career as a child actress, being born and raised in the Los Angeles suburbs by wealthy parents. Her breakthrough came in the 2010 film True Grit, and since then she's landed many TV and film roles from Bumblebee to The Edge of Seventeen and much more. Hilly is also a musician, and her 2016 single Starving was a definite chart topper. With a net worth estimated at about $10 million already, the 24-year-old could have afforded to move out of her parents' house years ago, but she was no doubt comfortable at the family mega mansion. Now it seems she's finally left the nest with the purchase of a new multi-million dollar home, but it's only about 30 minutes from her parents' house. Hey guys, it's Kara the Vampire Slayer back with another exclusive house tour here on Famous Entertainment. You guys requested this one, so today we're checking out the mansion of Haley Steinfeld. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit me up on Instagram to chat, and now let's get into this video. While Haley's fame and fortune could have afforded her a lavish house years ago, she chose to live with her parents in their California mansion for a while. After all, it was a setup the actress claimed to absolutely love, and it's easy to see why. While we don't know the details of her family home, it's located in the Thousand Oaks neighborhood of California, an upscale area also home to celebrities like Britney Spears. From aerial views, we can see that the home is massive and includes features outside like a sprawling pool. Back in 2016, Haley confessed on Jimmy Kimmel Live that she was quite happy to still be living at her parents' place, saying, I'm still at home, not ashamed. The actress also explained she considered moving out of her parents' house many times, but could never quite take the plunge. She continued, I have mornings where I wake up and I'm like, all right, this is it, I'm out, and then I leave town for a couple weeks and all I ever want to do is come home to a house full of people. It seems Haley has been able to remain down to earth even with all her success, partly due to her close bond with her family. While she's finally gotten a home of her own, I'm sure that bond won't change. While we can't see interior photos of Haley's Thousand Oaks mansion, reports say interiors span 4,556 square feet of space with five beds and four point five baths throughout. While the views we can see show a luxury backyard with a huge pool and spa setup that's hard to miss. The 2020 quarantine may have been Haley's final push to spread her wings and move. She admitted going into nearly a year of being locked up with the family was making her go kinda crazy. Haley was in quarantine with her mom Sherry, an interior designer, and her father Peter, a personal trainer, who also built a home gym on the property. Her older brother Griffin, who's a professional race car driver, was also staying at the family home. We can see that Haley utilized the home gym her dad built during the pandemic, and she had set herself up a home studio to work as well. More recently, Haley snagged herself her very own mansion, but luckily, the Encino property is less than 30 minutes away from her childhood home, so she isn't going too far. In November 2021, it was reported that Haley bought her first home off of rock star John Fogerty of the group Credence Clearwater Revival, or CCR. She actually purchased the home for $8 million back in August, but it wasn't revealed at the time, and it's located in the Los Angeles neighborhood of Encino, an area growing more and more popular amongst the rich and famous. While Fogarty made a $1.2 million profit off the sale, he also did a pricey and thorough home renovation during his ownership. The house was only built in 2016, but the CCR frontman transformed the traditional mansion into a super contemporary and trendy work of art. I mean, it doesn't even look like the same place. Nowadays, the mansion looks completely different, boasting features like reclaimed wood siding, stone walls, and disappearing glass doors, just to name a few. The property spans over half an acre of land, and Haley's new home is set at a small and less known street in a leafy and tree-lined area of Encino. Her house is also hidden from the 
streets, behind tall gates, and boasts a state-of-the-art security system, along with home automation. The entrance of the estate is eye-catching, with soaring ceilings and a curved staircase, as well as two shiny chandeliers overhead. The mansion boasts an open-plan layout, and there are lounges on either side of the foyer. One of the rooms seems to be a formal living area, with double-height white brick fireplace and a chic black and white theme. Opposite that room, the other lounge offers violet-colored walls, a black vaulted ceiling, another fireplace, a wet bar, and a moody vibe. Haley's residence spans a total of 9,000 square feet, almost double the size of her family mansion, with six bedrooms and eight baths throughout. The formal dining room has plenty of mirrors and an expensive chandelier styled to look like falling raindrops. The kitchen area is less formal, made up of a neutral color scheme, but no less impressive. The all-new kitchen boasts a white Quartz Island, breakfast bar, and glass cabinets. A motorized glass door here opens fully to the backyard, giving the entire space the ideal indoor-outdoor vibe. This area blends into a family room which flows easily together and looks like the perfect space to hang out. This room boasts an entertainment wall, built-in modern fireplace, hardwood floors, and more glass sliders out to the pool. Another hangout option is the soundproof movie theater in Haley's Mansion, which is set up with tiered seating and a completely black theme, making it feel extra cozy. Upstairs, the master suite is the perfect retreat for the actress, and it's centered by a double-sided fireplace which warms up the sleeping quarters and the separate sitting room. The master also has dual walk-in closets and dual bathrooms, one of which offers a unique stainless steel bathtub and elegant vanity. Aside from the five guest rooms, each of which have their own ensuite, another impressive feature of the home is the plush rooftop terrace, which has comfy furnishings and views of the San Fernando Valley, as well as a mountain range in the distance. Out in the backyard, Haley has a paradise to unwind or entertain friends and family. There's a handful of dining terraces, much of which are shaded from the sun. There's also a full outdoor kitchen and bar. Other features include a barbecue center, sitting area with outdoor fireplace, and of course, the impressive swimming pool with built-in spa and water feature. Mature trees protect Haley's property for extra privacy, and they also have string lights wrapped around the trunks for the perfect nighttime ambiance. Now that we've seen where Haley Steinfeld currently calls home, I think that brings our house tour to an end. While we know the young star loved living at her parents' mansion in Thousand Oaks, I think she was just waiting for the perfect crib to come along. And it seems like she found that in her new mansion. What do you guys think about her stylish Encino estate? I think every detail was thought out and it was renovated and modernized to the nines. It's no wonder Haley jumped in to buy it as her starter home. What was your favorite feature? I love the unique theme in each room and how differently every space was designed, all the fireplaces inside, and of course the jam-packed backyard. Be sure to let me know your favorite thing about Haley's home down in that comment section. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow me over on Instagram to chat, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!